Halloween so you know Halloween is coming at the end of the month as you know you should know on the 31st and so I partnered with Dress Lily to bring you some of the cutest costumes and Halloween gear that they have so um that's what I'm gonna bring to you in the video so we're gonna try on these different costumes these different Halloween pieces see what works and see what doesn't work before we go ahead and jump into the video and get started, make sure that you're following my social medias. <laughs> on my social media accounts, on my Facebook and my Instagram, I post every day. So make sure that you're locked in so that you don't miss a thing. And that way we're able to interact on a daily basis versus how we interact now on YouTube. And I have an exciting announcement about that. So stay tuned to the end of the video or in the middle of the video. You never know. So you got to watch. So you can hear the announcement. But let's get into these Halloween pieces. Okay, so this is a nun outfit. This is a sexy nun. Check the thigh. <laughs> yes, yeah, so it has the cutout up here. Now it does it doesn't snap it you hook it in the back but i can't get it and i'm scared if i put it on i won't be able to get it out get get it off rather so i'm just not gonna hook it up but it has a little plus i'm gonna say plus sign a little cross action right here at the neck and it has the cut out it's long sleeve and it's fitted but it does have a lot of stretch to it it has the lace here and along the bottom. Check it out. See, this is where it's supposed to be hooked, but it's not. But it's okay, don't judge. We're not judging here. This is a judge free zone. Yes. What do y'all think about this one? This is a cute little sexy number. You can actually put some heels on with it. That'll be cute. Yes. Okay, I'm not gonna twerk in a nun costume. I mean, I guess it, it doesn't matter because I mean, like, trick or treat witches. Is that what it says, right? Oh, it just says trick or treat. I added the other part. But isn't this cute? I literally fell in love with this when I saw it on the website. Um. It's stretchy. And like, I'm definitely wearing this all month. You might see me in this in December just because I like how it fits. It's got that white against this. I call it pecan tan. I call myself pecan tan. Might be a little in between. I think pecan tan is a fair assessment. What y'all think? But anyway, this white against this pecan tan melanin. <laughs> Yes. So it's a hook on the back that is not attached as you can see. Um I could probably do it. I'm not though. I'm definitely not. Because nails and it gets tricky. But this is really, really cute, y'all. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm gonna have an outfit to wear if I'm going. Hmm. Oh, I forgot I was still recording. <laughs> Cause your girl is still recording. 
in a trick or treat outfit. Trick or treat. Trick or treat. Okay. Oh, wait, I should walk gracefully. I feel like I'm floating. I always see like nuns and movies floating. <laughs> Did I float, y'all? <laughs> giving you none vibes there's none realness now i don't normally this is covered so this must be like a little sexy nun outfit this is super cute like it has a lot of stretch and it's got split on the splits on the side oh just the one split i apologize like I said, lots of stretch, long sleeves. <laughs> like, this is really cute and it's comfortable, which I love. And it has a headpiece, which is super easy to put on. It's just like you just put it over your head like this. But this is cute. And it's not super thin either. Not sure if you can see my bra, but it's because it's pink. And I didn't think about that before I started putting this outfit on. That's neither here nor there. But definitely, you can wear this. I don't know, like, what we're going to do this year. Like, you know, have little small Halloween gatherings. But in the event that you do, you'll be ready. Especially if you put a mask on. Like, you could probably even put this. I'm not going to do it because I have makeup. But cover your mouth with it on and put a mask up under it. You can even put a mask on with this. That'll be more protection for you, but definitely make sure that you stay safe. But this costume is cute. I like it. Wait, where's my phone? Oh. If I close this, I'll look like a nun. This is a closer nun as I'll be is in this costume. Okay, no, it don't work. Um, this is definitely colorful. Um, getting 70s vibe, vintage feels. Um, this would be a really cute costume. Um, you could be like a 70s homemaker or you could be like a deranged killer. Netflix when they got stuck in like the 70s and then they had to it was like a, a realm or something and they had to break out of it. I can't remember what it's called if you remember let me know in the comments but this is what this reminds me of like 70s homemaker kitchen cooking and whipping vibe but it's super cute it's not really stretchy but it, it is pleated at the waist so I really like that and it does, you know, it's dainty. <laughs> and it has this collar thing going on with the bow. This would be a really cute costume. I'm getting some ideas and going in my head. What do y'all think? But Oh, and some gloves, and then maybe like I can find those uh, those shoes they used to wear like in elementary school, the blue and white ones with the, I think it was like a reddish orange bottom with the laces. Okay. Now this is a, a, a skeleton dress, but my butt has the slip 
that goes up under the little high stuff in the back. In the bike. But this is cute. Otherwise, I would, you know, have to wear a little slip up under it, you know. So I don't risk flashing anyone. But this is cute, though. Like, if you get some, like, knee-high little skeleton um, socks or something like that, that'll be real cute, too. Um, it zips up in the back. You know, I just put it over my head. Um, let's see. Okay, that's the back. <laughs> it will not go over my butt. <laughs> yeah, but I don't like this. This is cute. But yeah, I would just have to add a slip up under it. So this is like tool material, of course. And it's stretchy at the top. Oh, wow, this is cute. It's got layers on it. I love that. What y'all think? Mine is still. Mine is me being an ass that. <laughs> All right. To the sexy skeleton. You don't know I'm going to have to put my hand. Got my ribs all out. This is the only time my ribs will be out. Or is it like somebody grabbing me? What y'all think? It's got a little hollow action going on. Now this is. <laughs> this is cute. I don't know if it's hand, but, I, oh, wait. Oh, yeah, this is like my bag, so this is bone. My vertebrae. Where is my vertebrae? I don't know. I'm just making stuff up at this point, but this is definitely cute. It's not super stretchy, it's cotton, so it does have a little give to it. Um, but it's got that flap in the back. I like how it, it's like got the hands in the right place, like you would be standing like this. It's not that picture, y'all. Wait, are my hands lined up right? Again, I don't even, I don't think it's supposed to be hand up. I think it's supposed to be my rib cage, but is it right? Okay, thank you. Was it Gladys Knight or? No, it's Patty LaBelle. And she like. <laughs> okay, what is this? It has, oh, okay. This is to put your finger in, I'm assuming. like some dominatrix type vibes it's got leather here and it's also got leather on the the little finger hole i don't know if it's supposed to be a finger hole but it's a finger hole today it might not be a finger hole i guess it could go either way but i like it as a finger hole all I need like is a little whip. Okay, it's extra flowy. It's got a lot of give to it. It's got that hollow action going on. 
There's nothing really in the back, but I love the cross crossbody at the top. I think that's called like crossbody action. Probably made it up, but it's cute. Like, I feel like I need like a little leather mask and some leather thigh high boots and my whip. Yep. Yeah. And the outfit will be complete. Like, I think you can wear this actually outside of Halloween, though, to be honest. If y'all see me in it. Now I do think I do think this is supposed to be a, um, a shirt. It's a shirt, but I wasn't about to get no other clothes, so I'm sorry. Just imagine it as a shirt. I mean, if you want to do it as a dress, you would always do it as a dress as well. I think like the common thing we have here today is that I pick a lot of stuff that involves skeletons. So this is like the third skeleton dress or shirt that I picked, but they're all cute. It's got like the little strings for the tie up action here. And these, I think these are, oh, these are hands on my boobies. These are all hands. That's gonna go on my boobies. I'm gonna do try it, okay? Anywho. So yeah, it's just regular in the bag. I love this. Y'all might think I'm corny and lame, but when it comes to like holidays and stuff, I'm super, super extra, super extra. So like, it looks like a normal dress, but this is really um, jack-o'-lanterns and scary houses and spiders and half moons. And it has a little peasant top at the, at the top. It's off the shoulder, so I of course have to wear, um, a strapless bra, but this is so cute. Y'all can call me lame all y'all want to, but, and this is like one of my favorite colors, this one, and like dark pink, but this is like my favorite color, and this is so cute to me. And it's like stretchy, it's comfortable, and I feel super sexy in it. Give a little shoulder action. What up? Oh, yeah, it goes all the way around. I could have just took it off and saw that. But this is cute. What y'all think? But it's super stretchy. Dress a shirt. Probably shirt, huh? Mm -hmm. It kind of gives me those dominatrix feels. This one actually buckles in the front of the other buckles. I had to put something on because if not, everything would be bad. But it's got the little, like I said, hollow action going on. Like you could definitely wear this with some leather tights to kind of go with the little buckle to get those dominatrix vibes. I don't know why I just lay my hair. I'm sorry. But it's a lot of stretch to it. And it's super comfortable. Okay, so don't judge me. I know y'all won't because y'all love me. But I saw this and I thought it was so cute. It's like lingerie, but it's got like little velvet bats on it. <laughs> okay, so when I saw this, like I automatically thought about wearing this, some high waist jeans and like maybe some boots or some other kind of heels or something. So that's what I thought of when I saw this, but I really, really like it. Like, I don't know what y'all got going on at home where you, um, you know, bats are sexy, but in my house, bats ain't sexy, but 
I like this little number. And it comes with some little, um, some little thongs too, honey. So, I mean, whatever you into, you know, get sexy with the batch. But, um, for me, I would probably wear this with some jeans. Because it's really, really cute. Yes. Like, where is it in the back? What's it doing in the back? Oh, it's just normal in the back. But yeah, I really like this. I don't care what y'all say. So y'all gonna see me with the bats and the half moons at some point in October with some jeans on. And it's gonna be cute. Who, who gonna say something? Get these bats on your ass. All right, so if you hung around thus far, the big announcement is they have this little cute purse. Isn't that cute? It's like pink snake skin. And it's like a mini purse. And those are in these days. I can put my cards. And maybe even leave it open and stick my phone in it. Yeah, I can stick my phone in it. And put a card or two. Isn't that cute? Or I can hold it like this. Okay, so that's not really the announcement. This is the announcement. This is a mask. Y'all know I was not putting this over my face with this makeup on, so. Mm -mm. I'll probably try it later, but just in case I don't. This is a mask, it's like a baby crying mask. I'm scared to put it on though, cause. Like, I don't know. I'm scared. I might try it. I might not. Okay, so this isn't the this isn't the announcement. So the announcement's yours. That I am not pregnant. Um, okay, so for real, for real. The announcement is, is that for the month of October and for the month of November. I'll be giving you drum roll please. Two videos a week. One, two. So you'll have a video on Tuesday at five, and you'll have a video on Thursday at five. Now the reason this is is because my channel is about like fashion, lifestyle, vlogging, makeup, fitness, all that kind of stuff. And I'm just getting backed up in my content. So the people have asked and I am fulfilling, fulfilling. So for the month of October and November, you'll be getting two videos a week. Now I'll kind of gauge it in January and see, you know, where we at or how I feel. But October, November, you'll get two videos a week. And then December, which is Vlogmas, that's when you'll get 25 videos. You'll get one video a day up until Christmas. <sighs> okay, I'm, I'm mentally preparing, but yeah. So yeah, the two videos a week will help me get prepared for Vlogmas, but I'll be able to handle it. Um, Anytime I make a commitment, I fulfill, and so that's what I'm going to do for you guys. But, yeah, because I'm getting backed up in my content, I'm going to give you the two videos per week. So, look forward to that. Now, excuse me, crying baby. So, guys, I do want to thank y'all for hanging hanging out with me as we went through this haul. Um, Dress Lily Halloween Plus Size Collection. They have some really, really, really cute stuff. And I'm, like... Every time I get clothes from Dress Lily, I just get more and more impressed with them. Like, especially, like, the way the clothes fit. Because you would think, um, the type of company that it is, is that the clothes wouldn't fit right. Or it would be, like, thin or not good material. But everything is really good material. Everything fits well. And I just like it overall. Um, let me know what you guys' favorites are in the comments let me know if you had one that you liked the most or even if you got one of those outfits and you have an idea of how i could wear it let me know in the comments also make sure that you like this video and make sure that you are subscribed to my channel so that when i post a video y'all will know 
y'all won't miss it. So make sure that you stay tuned Tuesdays and Thursdays at 5 p.m. You guys will get a video. I'm so nice, ain't I? I also have a coupon code for you guys because I know you love to save the coins. Save 22% off of your order with the code CANDY22. And that the code and the links will be in the comments. So save you some coins, y'all, for Halloween stuff or anything you want to buy. But use the code CANDY22 to save 22% off of your order. And always, I want to thank you guys for your love. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your feedback i thank y'all for thinking highly of me to watch me and be subscribed to my channel because i know y'all and for liking and sharing and you know doing all the things that you normally do because you love me and i love you <laughs> but thank you guys for watching i will see you in the next video bye bye <laughs>